Here we go. Hey, hi, Hunter Diver. Oh, God, that was such a good shot. Tripwire Interactive. That is right, guys. Today we're not playing a Roblox game. Today we are playing Man Eater. Yeah, it's this kind of uh, shark game where you are the shark and you like gotta kill people and do stuff. So what we're gonna do today is we're gonna be a, a bull shark. We're going to complete a tutorial and I will give you kind of a walkthrough of the game and stuff. And uh, then we will continue as babies when something in the story happens that I won't tell because I don't want to spoil you guys the stuff. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Um, I had that down, but it, I guess it reset. It, it got reset or something. Okay, so we're gonna play and we're going to start in a brand new slot, slot number two. And you guys will see how good of a game this thing is. If you can buy this game, I would definitely recommend it. It's um, 25, no, 28 dollars on Epic Games. Meanwhile, aboard the Cajun Queen, <laughs> Pierre LeBlanc, known by his fellow anglers as Scaly Pete. Scaly Pete. Dead on the sharks, high on sharks. It's in the blood. There was somebody better at this. You'd be following them, yeah. Oh, people. We got a lot of wrong ideas about sharks. Scientists say how we gotta coexist. Now, how you gonna coexist with that shark, huh? Shark just wanna do one thing. That's kill you, eat you, and you out. What I do, I consider a sacred honor. Kill them all if I could. Too bad, ain't but 24 hours to a day. Shark spotted in Fatik Bayou. Uh. Several deaths reported. Shark can be identified by rusty harpoon embedded in flank. Get the f out of my way. Got a job to do. I'm like so grateful that this game censors the bad words because if not, I would have to censor them. Oh god, look at that. This is an adult bull shark. Fast, fierce, and armed quite literally to the teeth. She has little to fear here in the Gulf. Uh keep current look settings, you can Yes. Okay, so guys, um marvel confidently moves through its watery world. Are you going to let me talk now? Okay, guys. So, uh, we're basically an adult bull shark because, um, well, yeah, because we're a bull shark. Like, that's how God uh, decided us to live. So, uh, yeah, we basically have a rusty harpoon in, like, uh, one of our fins or close to there. And so, basically, this game... Dude, isn't this like too loud? I don't know why I feel that. I hope this is not too loud and I hope this doesn't like screw up the video. But yeah, like we can we can bite and we can tail whip and we can do a lot of stuff being this shark. And so basically, uh yeah, I, I am I'm also like I really like this game especially because like they uh they do use bad words in this game, but like the bad words that they use, they censor them and I'm extremely grateful for that because you know I'm a family friendly channel and so every time that in a game they say a bad word I have to censor it but no the, this game does it for me so I'm extremely grateful for that so what we're gonna do is they basically present us with this whole load of fish that we just gotta eat because this is the tutorial right now so you can see we can simply just eat the stuff Let's see like that destroy these guys like that the turtles and as you can see we can like tail whip them and they will be like knocked off like that and i can also grab like this mahi mahi and i can throw it to the turtle like that it is it is incredibly cool so as you can see uh you can use tail whip to knock back and stun targets just what i said so we can just do this there you go. Exhibiting it's done. Behavior more common to a fresher shark. This bull makes creative use of her powerful tail. That's right. And so we just we can simply just tail whip these guys, these guys, and they just they just get a knockback. So yeah, right now we're an adult bull shark. It's pretty cool being an adult in this game. It's definitely better than being a baby or a teen because 
uh, it's much more difficult to be like a teen or a baby in this game. But like, look at this. Even an adult bull shark is not that big. Like, look at the mahi mahi. These things are huge. They're like half of my body. Literally, they're half of the shark. So yeah, what I like to do basically in this game, because I have played this game before, um, because like I just bought it, be I just bought it because it just came out really. But like, uh, I bought it and I played a lot. Like I have, I mean, I, I said this wrong. It's not like I just bought it. I bought it like a week ago and I already have like another shark. It's a Megalodon actually, not a bull shark. But, uh, and I have had like 12 or maybe 13 hours of gameplay in that world with that shark. But right now I just want to start a new one so that you guys can see how an adult bull shark can still get crapped up if, if it doesn't take care of itself. But guys, really, if you can buy this game, I would definitely recommend it. This is an amazing game, amazing graphics, amazing sound, amazing quests, amazing everything. It's just $28 on Epic Games, so I will leave a link to it if I can. And yeah, this this thing is just like this. This is, this is what it is. It's, it's amazing. So basically this is like the uh, the tutorial. So what we're gonna do, as you can see, we've got like little quests up here. You can see. A shark fan is a sinister reminder to humans that the ocean remains a wild and untamed domain. Exactly. So yeah, we can simply just like uh, start knifing with our fin so that humans get scared and know that there is a shark below them, which is incredibly cool. So, now, jump. You can jump into the air from the knifing position to reach enemies above the water. Press space to jump from knifing. So all we're gonna do is, I think we're going to attack this jet ski if we can. Oh, you see that? That is so amazing. And I can simply just like tail whip the jet ski until it breaks. So this game is so awesome, dude. Submerge. You can leave the knifing position by submerging with C. So C to submerge. The big fish plunges to the ocean below. Exactly. Oh my God! There we go. And you, the a tail whip. Speed is astounding for a large marine predator. Stop it, stop. Dude, this game is so, is so amazing. So, uh, breaching. Lunge with shift, I guess? Yeah, shift up towards the surface to breach out of the water. So we gotta lunge like this, guys. We gotta lunge three times. Calorie intensive spectacle. I also love like the, the narrator because this narrator is a famous actor and like it is a super familiar voice. It is actually, if you have seen uh, Rick and Morty, this is Jerry from Rick and Morty. Uh, and yeah, the narrator, uh, the only fact that there's already a narrator like telling you stuff, it's amazing, but also that it is like a narrator that you're like familiarized with if you like watch a lot of movies. And so that is incredibly awesome. So yeah, lunging, let's lunge once again. Like that, that's how you lunge. Once again, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to eat this turtle while we'll do it. Where are you, turtle? Go over here. Oh. Oh, it's dead! Oh, poor turtle, I didn't want to die like that, actually. Come over here, parrotfish, die. There we go. A uh, whip shot. Hold, click, and on. Hold right click on an object. Oh no, sorry. Hold left click on object and press right click to whip shot. So yeah, that's what we were doing earlier. You remember that? That like we we hold the. Oh, we hold right uh, left click. Oh my God, we hold left click like this, 
And what we do now is, oh no, 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 no! Dude, I trashed it. Oh no, that was not what I was planning. But look at this human, for example. So we grab this human, we go into the water, and we, uh, we whip shot like this. So yeah, basically that's whip shotting. You you grab prey and you then tail whip it while it's in your mouth and you can like lunge them off. It's it's amazing. We can eat this and it says. Uh so yeah, as you can see there is a quest log. I want to teach you about this. So we can't access evolutions right now because we're in the tutorial, but we can access the quest log, which is this where we will have much more quests. I will also have infamy ranks. Right now we don't have infamy points because it's a tutorial and you can't have them. But these are basically all the hunters that we have to hunt uh, in this game. And then, well, there's Scaly Pete, which is like the apex of them. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tear up the bay, kill 10 beachgoers. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna kill 10 beachgoers, the ones that are marked in red. While it is well known that sharks feed on mollusks, fish, and seals, less discussed is their propensity to feed on fear. So yeah, there we go. We start eating the sharks. I also want to like, uh, I don't want to talk a lot. As you can see, like I stay quiet in some moments because I want you guys to like, uh, hear the sound effects because they are so awesome and so I'm I'm gonna try to whip shot this guy well this guy's bad, dead <gasps> what is this inflatable unicorn yes now the humans that's what matters I also love like the animations of the shark they are amazing so wait, let's whip shot yeah let's send one of these humans to to the beach Oh, did I made it? Oh no, I crashed the human into another one. Quite unusual for a shark. Scaly Pete, center hunters after you. Okay, yeah. So that's. So now what they're gonna do is they're gonna hunt us down, and we gotta fight with these guys, and that will be basically the end of the tutorial. Come on, come over here. Oh yeah, a uh, boat combat. You can reach higher places like boat decks using air lunge. Lunge out of the water and bite humans off boats. Press shift while in air for a second boost. Uh, yeah, and Q and E to evade. Uh, F to focus th threat, sorry. I can just click Q or E to just dodge the, the lasers, uh, well, sh or the shots. Oh my god, dude! Die! Oh, King Mackerel. By the way, eating, I, I don't know if you already noticed it, but eating uh, heals us, which is awesome. However, there's something that I've been noticing about this game that like humans don't heal you a lot. They're like the thing that less heals you in this game, which is pretty weird. Because like this game is about eating humans. So I don't really know. Come on, die, mackerel. Where is the, the hunter diver that is trying to... Come over here. Come over here, pal. Take that. I'm gonna get this thing down. There we go. So, like, it is really cool to have, like, this in intense music. And like uh, Scaly Pete or other hunters talking while you fight, and it's it's just amazing how this game is developed. Really, like, dude, it really it really fits you into the game so much. Come on, take that, hunter.
Where's the boat? Woo! Take that turtle shot. Oh! Oh, I hit a diver with the other. Oh, sorry, I hit a hunter with the diver. Oh, that was awesome. Okay, there's another hunter diver. I think that was the one, but it is like weakened. I hope. Come on, come over here. Come on. Is there a hunter diver here? Yeah. Yes! That's what I like to do. I like to hit the hunters with the divers that I shoot them. Dude, what the crap? Stop it! There you go. That's what you get. Catch me to shock myself. Come on. Come on. There you go. Take that. Oh, what? Oh, yeah. We're gonna hunt. It. She gonna make quite a man of beast. So yeah, it's kind of a boss in the game, and this is like the elite hunter or elite Got hunter. Some dinner coming, boys. And yeah, there we go. We were pretty much fin Let's soup. Get her up on deck, huh? Now. On board the Cajun Queen, Scaly Pete looks over the catch of the day. <sighs> yeah, that's right, we're at the catch of the day, guys. Yeah. This my daddy's on, all right. But this ain't the shark. Not the one I was looking for. How do you know? How I know? Not big enough. This look like a mega to you. So yeah, now we get sliced up, oh, and then there's a baby. Look here. We are, we're pregnant. She's on for me. Hello. Oh, are your mama in there? Oh, but well, why'd you do that? So I can identify her. Next time I see her, when I spear her. The tiny pup responds with an instinct for survival. You'll never want to turn off the camera. So now what happens here is we are... Oh, God! Copyrighted music. Get out of here. Get out of here. Okay, yeah, there we go. And so what happens now is we are that pup. We are this baby shark. And posited that after an animal had tasted human flesh, it forsakes its natural prey in a deadly single-minded search for the most dangerous game. Yeah, awesome. And now shut up. So yeah, what happens with this game? The cool thing about this game is like like when you're a baby, like the movement and everything is like so fast. And like the world around you is so dangerous and so big and you feel scared. But when you are an adult, the world around you is like small and you feel like you feel like a little bit more slow and a little bit more of like the king of the deep, you know? So right now we're a baby, we only can bite, we only can bite, we can't tail whip uh, at the stage. Oh, we can grab like these the chest things. Is an animal of broad dietary proclivities. So yeah, uh, those are like chests that we can get for like things. So yeah, that is basically the game. I'm going to be bringing out more man eater to the channel because I really want to finish the game so that you guys don't like stay there. Like, well, then what happened next? So yeah. I am going to like uh, uh, evolve into a level two pup, and then I'm gonna end the video there, so that like you guys see. So we already completed the tutorial, and we're now a little baby over here. So I'm just gonna eat a little bit, level up, and oh yeah, wait, I didn't show you guys. So yeah, evolutions. We can basically evolve uh, and upgrade our shark. We can upgrade the jaw, the head, the body, the fins, the tail, the organ, oh well, and three organs. And this is like so cool because we will be growing. Right now we're one meter with 10 centimeters, but we will be growing much, much more, which is real cool. So yeah, right now this is a level three catfish. This is really difficult for me to eat and I actually have to eat it like this and eat the big pieces like that 
over here grouper oh yeah and this over here this is the grotto uh the grotto is like our safe place where we can evolve and upgrade our shark once more the shark turns back to this place of centered call press i to open the evolution panel oh we've got art in oregon uh advanced sonar uh, nutrients are resources gained by eating wildlife, humans, boats, or quests. Okay. So, yeah, basically, we've got an advanced bio sonar, which will help us um, find prey that is uh, long from us. So, for 50% sonar radius, and but minus 10% sonar cooldown. Exhibiting behavior more common to whales and dolphins, this shark is able to use biosonar to locate potential prey. And that right there is a muscalunge. Now, muscalunges... Yeah, there we go. That was what I was going to say. Wildlife combat. Wildlife can be hostile. Evade to dodge their attacks. When you see the wildlife glow, they are vulnerable. Yeah, that's right. My pronunciation is the best. Attack while they are vulnerable to stun them. Press Q or E to evade, like we found out uh, earlier. And you can also thrash by holding click. And you can use focus threat with F. So yeah, that is wildlife. That is the muscle lunge that I was talking about. But I'm just going to get out of here. Okay, so here we go. This will be our first fight as a baby with, against, against this little thing, because this is aggressive actually. Oh yes, we can thrash it, and there you go. We're done with it. Okay, so mucky business, destroy the target. It's a hunted muscalange. This thing seems like a little bit, oh my god, dude, stop it. This thing seems like a little bit bigger than the others. Take that. Oh, there's a, uh, a like a smaller muscalange, where is it? Oh my god, dude, that thing, that thing bites hard. Okay, come on, die. So yeah, these uh, hunted thingies are like mini bosses. And then we will fight uh, against apex predators, which are bosses. And then we will fight against Scaly Pete, which is like the mega boss, to be honest. Or to like to say it like that. Come on, die. Like, I'm a shark, dude. You're like a freaking fish. Come on. There we go. Muskie is a freshwater fish commonly found throughout the Great Lakes region. So I have no idea what it's doing here. Yep. Yep, that's right. Okay, so completing story quests unlocks a like side. Oh my god, dude, what the where did you come from? Come on, die. Okay, yeah, so we can uh, take a look at the quest log. Catfish fever. Fever. Female catfish, yeah. The overhunting of Fawtix Keystone Predators has led to a super abundance of catfish, which is just fine by local bully Rosie the Alligator. Yep, so now we're going to uh, go against these uh, catfish, which we're going to kill because of overpopulation. So we're gonna go 170 meters uh, to the catfish, which as you can see are marked in red. Here we are, what? Oh God, I'm not prepared for you. Get out of here, get out of here. Dude, I'm, a, I'm just a baby! Leave me alone! I'm just trying to eat some catfish! Oh my god, another one?! Oh no, this can't be good! Give me the catfish, now! Oh, I ate a grouper, are you kidding me? And this thing is after me, there are two of them. Oh no. This can't be good, guys. 
Come on, I need these catfish thingies to die fast. Three alligators. Three freaking alligators. They're gonna, they're gonna make, they're gonna slice me up. What the heck? Stop it. Stop bullying me. I'm just a baby shark. Oh God, this is not good guys. This is not good. I became, I became the most hunted of the party. Okay, come on, we gotta, we gotta kill these guys before we die. Oh God, oh God. Come on, fast. Come on, get out of here. I don't want to fight against you guys. I'm just, I'm just a baby. Keystone predators has led to a super abundance of catfish, which is just fine by local bullying. Okay, one Rosie alligator is off, and the other one is too, is off too. So yeah, we have basically reached level two, and we are now one meter and twenty centimeters, guys. So yeah, uh, actually, I'm gonna leave it like this because I think I like it better. So yeah, guys, I hope you really enjoyed this episode of Man Eater. If you did, don't forget to leave a like down below. Oh my god, why do I keep saying it wrong? <laughs> don't forget to leave a like and leave a comment down below in the comment section. Um, tell me if you like Man Eater and I will keep uploading these kind of videos. Tell me what other game you would like to see in the channel. I will try it out. And I will see you guys in the next episode. So goodbye.